So welcome, it's BBC Radio One Extra with your boy Shawnee B in Kingston, Jamaica. We are up in the hills at the Skyline Levels venue. A very cool, breezy evening with the Kingston backdrop behind us right here. And this is a special series that we're doing called One Night With. Now, these One Night Withs that we are doing at the Skyline Levels, this is going to be an in-depth conversation with artists that have contributed so much to this music, Jamaican music, and artists that I believe that actually don't get the respect that they deserve. And the man that is joining me this evening, Junior One Blood Reed, is one of those. Welcome, Junior One Blood Reed. Blessed love, blessed love. So, Junior, for this conversation, I never ever profess to say that I know it all. As we were just talking about just a second ago, I'm a fan of the music. I've been buying your music for over the years. You, you as Black Uhuru, you as Junior Reed, and you as your label, JR. Now, I want you to take me back to the very beginning of your career. You grew up in Waterhouse, um, Kingston, Jamaica. When did you first discover your love for music? When did you know that you had a talent for music? Well, when I, when I find out I have talent for the music is, you know, when I was growing up in my community, you know, and the love, the neighborhood, the fans and everyone, you know, the people around, you know, just let me know, say, well, something special about me, you know, so when I leave school and come home and me entertain the street, crowd at my gate and them thing there, and you have some, you have youth club, we put on some activity in the era, you know, regularly, so whenever they have any little talent show and them thing there, I always take part in them show and you have man with, with big money for your stay on and big money for take on who the, take off who the man take off. So the man always a bid for me to stay on from the stage and thing. Just by doing those shows and so, you know, start get interest from the sound system, sound system them in the community and so. Let me start to sing from a couple of sound system and they like Studio Mix, Master Blaster, King Jammies, you know, sometimes go to town. You know, youth promotion, Kilimanjaro, Leeds Unlimited, the snuff sound and so so. How how old was you during this time? Them time they were thirteen, I got fourteen. Thirteen years yeah. of age. How how did you get out of the house at that age? Well, I live with my grandmother them time there, so you know, say your grandmother don't really pay much attention sometimes, you know, when I get up in her age, so sometimes you get the chance to sneak out and just go do your thing, come in forward and so you understand me? So that's how I do it, you know. And then in my area, I go on all the vibes. Then we have a bridge, you know, named Irons, and a youth named Miguel. They bring, they bring forth you Mundell in the area. So you Mundell come in the area. So we get the link with you Mundell, and he start hearing me and sing, and I say, yo, you have it in a youth. So I say, yeah. And them time I tell him, I say, well, I really DJ, I like DJ. And so I more I do the DJ thing, and I say, no, I sing it for sing. And do, you, do you remember any of the lyrics and that you used to DJ? Yeah, man. Back then. Yeah, you man. can't give us a blast or something. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, it's an yeah. in-depth one today. Yeah. Um, listen now. Mr. DJ, sir. What part of Mr. DJ, sir? You understand me? All right. Me's a man who used to give Nicodemus lyrics. You understand me? Because me's a man where, you know, the community, Nicodemus, you know, come visit the community every every day. And them cook food and them things. They cook food, man. Make up some lyrics like me, I give him lyrics like, say, um, You can't take my mother in law. Me can't take my mother in law. You understand oh, oh, me? Wait, hold on. Me hold use on. a broad board and me box up on a job. Me can't take them tune. You understand so, so, me? Slow down for me right here, yeah. Julia. You read those lyrics for yeah. Nicodemus. Yeah. And me have a next one, me give me, say, Get up this morning and me water me plant. Take up my Bible and me chant, me start it to chant. Policeman, them joke me down, me ask them where they want. They ask me where me work around a molly and plant. They ask me who me live with, me tell him, say, me aunt. Him looking at me house, me have everything me want. Them kind of, you know, them style so. Demos love me, not leave me. So that's why even when the demos them come, come check demos and say, them want to be a demos. Him, say, him tell him, say, we have to go check Junior reading. You know. That's why the first demos named Junior demos. But I was just about to say, you yeah, know, say your me. voice. I'm a little junior demon. You sound like a junior demon. You sound like a junior demon. You try to talk like me, but this is my natural talk. It's the next demon. Them now, a junior read them talk like us. 
Demos don't tell him if he reach the Demos and I've got to cut you. That damn man, I don't have a link. So when Juno Demos come and him say, oh, I stand up, so my shoes stand up. So he, he see him stand up, I saw him stand up in his shoes sideways. Why pose? And him talk like how me talk. But naturally, I saw me talk. You understand me? So, you know, sometimes I catch him talking in a real voice, too. <laughs> <laughs> so are you telling me that Juno Demos don't sound like that, huh? Yeah. Yeah. It not sound like that. Demos have no voice, man. I <laughs> me have no voice too. But this is my voice. This is how me talk. So me inspire them youth there. Because when them youth there come and say, yeah, Demo, that's why I'm say, I'm say Juna Demos. You understand me? So big up Juna Demos and you understand all Demos. You understand me? But a water house, the whole thing start from. You understand so me? So I have to ask, knowing that you wrote lyrics like that, lyrics yeah. that we all know and love. Even, 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 all right, so you see when we say, me, when me I do DJ thing, I'm only like, you money that say, no, leave that. Man. Number DJ, I sing it first, sing them time, you money that sing, you know. Then even you money, me, me and you money DJ, um, DJ sang together with me, I say, oh, I'm Junior Reed, where I'm on a DJ? You're not going to dance. Me say, yo, the man fill us up some feet and wait, man. And you money say, where are you, man? We can't pay the rent. Run, come, come in, and they dance, dance, dance. Now stay, you don't know that you money the Junior Reed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I, from them time, where I do it, man. So why did you choose the singing over the DJ? I choose singing. Mm. Well, you know, go a dance one night and them boo me at the dance. So them boo me the night at the dance. I feel away so so bad as someone at me say a man in the crowd I say, I sing if you sing and then we go sing. <laughs> and we sing the whole place mash up and from that me not bother DJ again because me not me not, me not work on a boo. <laughs> what would you After say the, was your first breakout song that really stamped that name Junior Reed? All right. Well, the first one, a breakout that is, yeah, um, let's say, far in mind. Yeah. Far in mind. Uh, minibus driver kind of, Bill of Vibes. And so, after know myself, minibus driver, then, then you have J-Lo's and you have them sang there. No, not J-Lo's. No, you have far in mind. We could just stop at far in mind. We could just yeah. stop at far in yeah, mind. Because for me, as a young selector coming up, that, was, that, that record was the, one of those foundation songs them that you have to play alongside, like a greetings and your super cat them, and mm -hmm. that fitted in the jugglings, original foreign man. Now, I had a conversation with Gappy Crucial mm -hmm. from the UK, mm -hmm. and he told me about a story mm -hmm. of where foreign man was written. Mm -hmm. He told me that it was written in his kitchen. In his kitchen? Uh, yeah, yeah, in Brixton. Um. Oh, oh foreign mind come out is like, you know, at the time, you know, everyone was crazy, one us go foreign and them thing there, mm -hmm. so and so. And you know, um you used, used to go on a dance and sing sing it. Cause them time there, <coughs> you, you sang even your song get big before it even reach before it release. Or before it even reached my radio, you understand me? So we used to go around all of these sound systems that I mentioned and we sing them song, them song they get big and so. We even go to England and sing it too, and so, you know, but, yeah, maybe, you know, maybe we're going to get some inspiration when we're in England. When you so in England. Yeah. This is the original foreign mind. You must see them, you must see black hand. Worry them, I worry them, I worry them, I worry them. I must see them, you must see black hand. Worry them, I worry them, I worry them, I worry them, foreign mind. Hey, go on. Say foreign is a place where people comes and go. When some people go to foreign, they say, then forget all about their bread But Kayano is living so poor. And right now we stand here sleeping on the floor. Can't you see? Worry them, I worry them, I worry them, I worry them. I must see death, they must see blind. Worry them, I worry them, I worry them, I worry them far in mind. Give me the mix, come and say, round up on me ambition. This guy's here, don't go blind. Who played a tour with them and they, you can live in Radigan. Stick it in one hoin, and they're hitting one hoin. Standing it in one hoin, and they're hitting one hoin. We go to England, girl, and treat me fine. Take me to the club, we drink expensive wine. Me run go back a yard, got me no foreign mind. Me run go back a yard, me love my sunshine. New York nice, but in the Canada nice, but in the 
take it on, man. I don't say enough foreign at the house, you know. Enough traveler in the house, enough people travel all over the world, you know. So I want to tell when foreign nice and when you know nice and when Jamaica nice. Say it's what I say. New York nice what in there? Canada nice what in there? Say England nice what in there? Tell them say Africa nice. Tell them say Jamaica nice. Give me the mix. Living in Jamaica, don't stop a red eyes. Cook me food, channel you know be nice. I can banana for me lunch, we eat it by the bunch. Me relax in a coach, I drink me fruit punch. Any girl pass me, say, I honey bunch. Can I take you out to dinner, take you out to lunch? Then we go, stick it in one hoi, nanny, I hang it one hoi. Lord, stick it in. Oh, my son, oh, my stay, oh, my love. We made you rocks now for Jerry to work. Wife in the kitchen, she a cook. No, no food I feel me lunch. No, no food get me in the mood. Some say me bad, some say me rude. Look how me smooth, look how me smooth. Look how me black, look how me shine. Catch it's a secret not to keep in my head. Some love the lemon, but me love me lime. Jenny wants me close, she hanging on the line. Worry them, I worry them, I worry them, I worry them. So I say, I say, life is one big road with a lot of signs, a lot of signs. You better make up your mind to face reality behind. Hey, so many of sorrows, many a joy. Life can be fun, but never a joy. Men they got good time. Give me a kiss, give me a kiss, hello. This kind of system will travel you met. But when the sun comes shine tomorrow, it come bless and come down the other day. You won't take my advice, I explain to the crowd and say halfway up, halfway down. I'm not hearing, I'm not hearing the sound coming through the to I'm not hearing the instrument through the mic clearly, you know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, hey, hey. Many your problems, many a day. Some keep searching for the better way. Many of good times, many a bad. But thanks for all those times that I have. But when the sun comes shine tomorrow, it comes blaze and come down the other day. You want to take my advice, I speak to the crowd. And Sam, we up every day. You have so so many seminal moments in your career. Right. Um, how difficult was it for you, or how difficult was it for young artists coming through during that time? Um, well, it, it it never really difficult for young artists coming through them time because as as we say, we used to work with the sound system. You understand me? So one time we go at the dance tour, the people them don't go in at the dance till them see the artists them come. So promote his PAV and when the PAV, you know, the people in my country are in a town, them, them just lurks out of the dance gate. They now nah go in a dance. He says an artist ride and I reach, then you see people start rush the gate, the gate get ramp. And we go in and them thing there. And you two saw more chance, you know, for, for, for reach the people. Mm -hmm. it, um let's say reach the people naturally instead of like the social media. Social media help and them look at things there, you know. Mm -hmm. We have so much artists right now in other world. Everybody are artists now. But them time there, you know, I just who really love it and want to do it. I have to reach out and try to make it happen, you know, in the street. And once it happened in the street, then the reader start take on to it and I say it go. You know, one time it told me Angle Town to the president that I have in town, you find out it's a promoter from Monty go be a watcher, right? I start to come to town and say they want to book me. Them time that I don't have no release yet. Drive, go down to the country, work, perform, get my money and come back to town. And then we start getting interest from overseas and so on. So then it just keep growing, you know. And so it wasn't that hard for you and them thing there, for coming out of the business. 
Now it's even, you know, now it's even pressuring for some youth for coming out of the business, cause all the business still right you now, you know, them, you know, youth have forgot through so much things, you know, them time, yeah. and so much twist and so much turn, you understand me? Forget, mm. for even get the opportunity where they really want, and you understand me? Did you, did you do the riding in truck back and all of these things, going to these dances? Yeah, man. Me a man drive from, me used to drive from the truck back with the son. I go all of these country where we are telling so we get money. Some, <laughs> we get money for work. And even before, before the drivers them start, the promoter them start drive and come to town, come pick me up and carry back to town. You slept on the country truck, sometimes the wheel bind. And you, know, you understand me? Some of you know that um, truck wheel can bind. The stock and can move and pace. <laughs> can't move, move them your thing, stock. <laughs> Enough man drop off a truck and dead and all them things. Oh, man. seriously. All kind of thing go on. You understand me? So when Get people talk about... and our truck run over precipitate, all kind of thing go on, you know? So when people talk about sound system culture, yeah. this is where it's really all coming right. from. And people lost their lives during this time. Right. Sure, man. It's not an easy road for the sound system. And the, you know? It's a rough journey. You understand me? Yeah, so we just keep on doing it on the sound system and get enough inspiration from you, Mondel, and so till we meet up my sugar miner and um we have some rhythms we, we produce and we get from jammies, some of them and some other one we produce. So we produce human nature and love mama and them song there. And um human nature and um GLOs, all of them song there. You understand me? Black man seed. And then me and him come to, then we produce foreign mine together, me and sugar mine at. And then sugar mine have some other tracks that I done for him and then we put them all together and come with this album Foreign Mine. You understand me? Great album. Where did Black Uhuru come in this part of the conversation now? And how did you join well, oh, oh, Black Uhuru come into this part now is is after foreign mine now. And I went and toured with Sugar Minot, Dan Carlos, and so, yeah, Michael Palmer, and all of it. We go up on tour. Um, while I'm on tour, you know, I heard that Black Row have some problem with, you know, with lead singer. They need a lead singer, and so. So, them telling my career just take off. Foreign Minot, the artist singing of the world, and mash up the whole world. You understand me? Some years say, well, the mother like to get me involved in the group or maybe a part of it and from the group, you know what I'm saying? So, you have enough people that encourage me to say, yeah, it's a good idea. Some people say, no, you just, your career just started, uh, you can't go cool up, you say, right? But we just, we just go, to, go in a black room for the love of the music, you understand me? Because the love of the music and the love of the community. Because no one say, me is a youth from Kingston 11 Waterhouse, and no one say, the first Grammy Award group it's from Waterhouse, and as the group go, as the group go win the gram, as the group win the Grammy now and everything, there comes the separation and so. So I say that not really look good. You understand me for my community and for even the music. So I say I go sacrifice my career then and, and put it on hold and go support and strengthen the group and say so. With my first hit when I get into the music, me just leave that so far in mind and, and go in a black rock just to strengthen them and make a thing there and. You know, me and him go up on tour, Europe, America, the islands and all over. You understand me? And after we done that and so, we do, we, let me see, we come back, we do the first album, came back and do the next album. And we do the next album named Live in New York City. And so, and then after that now, you know, some local vibes like one of the group, you know. But, you know, some local vibes, you know, so, we just decide for several, all right. If the vibes are going, you know, and anything with them want to do, them just do what them do. So I find out, say, me is a man now where I produce, me, me, me say, well, Black Row is a group where I always I work on the Island Records and all the mm -hmm. masters from Black Row owned by, by Island Records. So me have my GR Records label, because you know, when Black Row get split up, you know, the first song came out and with Black Row, it came out on GR label, you know, Let Us Pray and um, Conviction Are Fine and Pain Upon the Poor Man Brain. Now I get rich and switch. All those songs came out on the GR label. So GR label is a label that, that rescue Black Uru when them leave. When them, when them leave off Island Records. Okay. So you see, GR Records is just big like Island or even bigger. You understand me? Yeah, so you find out, say, you know, while 
while me stay so now in the studio, uh, me I should look at so we work on some master for yourself now. While me in the studio, I work on the masters and them thing there. Which, which that those masters would be like one blood married life and all of them. So this is when you were still a part of yeah, Black still Uhuru. part of the group, yeah. Oh. So me there, me there studio, I work on them songs. So yeah. you was and utilizing they, the studio and yeah. space and the time. And, yeah, and then we're supposed to come to the studio, and then enough, enough time, book studio time, and, and advice, and so I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, the rest of the member them come to the studio. So you know me do now, we just go and vice and vice and do my thing. So I get find out say, you know, it's like them have different plans. So as soon as them have different plans, you now to me believe in myself as Junior Reed, because me not really leave Black Rue, you know. Mm -hmm. You understand me? Cause me, 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 you understand me? After. I find out, say, me, me they are true, they are put in the work and them don't come. And so that, me, that show me, say, they're not really interested. So we just come out with one blood, come out with the album as Junior Reed. And we come out with one blood, one blood, take over the whole world. So you were still signed up with. No, me, me and them, no, me and them, me never, really, me never really signed. Yeah, you're, I know you're not a fan of the contract. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. How everybody laugh when I say that. <laughs> no, me, me just stop work with them and I do my own thing. You understand me? Because I believe in me and a lot of people that say, boy, it's hard for you to leave, like when you leave your solo career and you go into the group and then now for comeback solo. Do you, you understand me? Did that cause any friction within the group when you dropped this album, knowing that you're still part of the group, but you've no, dropped no, I, this? No, no, I wasn't a part of the group. I leave the group that time, you know. Okay. You understand me? Because I don't have time for wait around and everything. So we just, we just put out the works and them things. They them feel away now for no so well. One Blood was supposed to be a Black Rose song and, and, and all of them songs, Married Life and... You understand me? Them songs, they just come out and so. So, from come out, we just start doing my thing, and do my thing internationally, locally, all kind of like. You see me, I say? And when we do his history, because in the history of music, you, never, you hardly find, say, an artist leave him solo career and, and go into. Be leave from the bands. Group, okay. Right. And, and then, then come back out. Again. And then, and then, and no, leave from him solo career and go into a group. You understand me? Mm -hmm. And then come back out and still, you always find artists leaving group and go solo. But me leave my solo, go into a group and leave back <laughs> and go back solo. And enter the group with foreign mind, which is a hit, and leave the group with a hit, which is one blood, is another and hit again. And then you come back out again yeah, with another so, hit. You know, so you know, so man like we is not a one hit wonder, which wonder when we go and get another hit, keep <laughs> hitting. You understand me? We keep doing the thing. When you recorded One Blood, did you know that it will be the record that is come and still is in 2023? Um, no, I never know that. You know, because when a man do put in, when I put in work, you know, you never know which song going really make the mark for you. You understand me? You have to just do good work, and then it, the works will tell you know. You come from jungle, who that come from firehouse, or you come from to what? One blood, one, one. Hear me now. You could have come from Libya, or you come from America. Who that come from Europe, you come from Africa. One blood, one, one blood. You could have be an Irishman or an Englishman. Could have be a Mexican. Are we not Pakistan? One blood, one blood, one blood. Hey, mate, why? I want you to get me straight. Corporate, yeah, I might, I might. I want you to get me straight. Blood, hey, God, no, 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 You could have come from uptown, you come from downtown. You could have come from another town, you come from round town. One blood, one, one. You could have come from London, you come from Birmingham. You could have come from Brooklyn, you come from Boston. One blood, one blood. Yeah, I'm about Colombia. And I feel Spanish people must speak down there. Yeah? I'm going to say, you know, someone, I've got to get used to this one. Someone else.
get you sweet and add more juice to it. So you want your one brother in Spanish? You want to hear one brother in Spanish? I'm going to give you one brother in Spanish. It goes like this. Una sangre, una sangre, una sangre. Se si venite you, si venite Guatama, si venite Ieti, o venite Italy. Una sangre, una sangre, una sangre. Si venite Guatemala, o venite Ecuador, si venite Ieti, o venite Italy. Una sangre, una sangre, una sangre. Compañera, que me que se ha sincera. Oh, I stand your heart, Campanera. Uh huh. Quiero que sea sincera. Standing in my heart. Say, si venite Guatemala, o venite Ecuador. Si venite Ieti, o venite Italy. Una sangre, una sangre, una sangre. Otra. Pura con fan mi ima, yo con fan chonga. Pura con fan paya osa, yo con fan toa. One blood, one blood. One blood. It's funny yeah, it's when like I play that record, cause I play that record a lot when I do festivals, any show that I do, as a matter of fact, and I use that as a record to unify the different races and cultures that are in the audience. Yeah. But the lyrics start with, you could have come from Rima, you could have come from Jungle. What inspired you to write that song? Even though we're, we're all aware of the political violence in the inner city communities of Kingston and the rest of Jamaica on a whole, but what really made you take a stance, stand up, and have to write that song? Well, what made me write that song there is, you know, I was aware, you know, because I used to be based in, in England, you know, and so, so I leave England, I come to Jamaica, I come to Jamaica now, you see the whole place is just, you know, under attention, you know, nobody in the on the street, everybody has seen, because they say, yo, oh, where, 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 and if and, I drive out on the street and make two drive. I remember drive is like a ghost town and so. I mean, I say, really? No, this is serious. Then now, me hear, when I'm reaching, I tell me, say, yo, you know, say, you have some youth in America where a war against them, one of them, cribs and bloods. And I make a thing that a youth might kill off them, one of them, and rave. I mean, I say, yeah. I mean, I say, yeah. Oh. And I mean, I say, yo, the same thing I go on. Don't in a Jamaica, you don't go and say PMP and labor right, but a cribs and blood, same way. You understand me? Some of us say, I'm going to check down a, down a dream and jungle. They're my neighbor. A neighbor should live loving with each other. You understand me? Neighbors and neighbors must be friends. Because neighbors are there for each other. You understand me? You have to love your neighbor like you love yourself. So watch it now. We just come say, you know, it's a vampire thing I go on. Because even when a man use a gun and shoot a man, a blood is run, run to, right? So a different kind of different kind of vampire thing are going Because some man teeth are them going, you know. You understand me? And you have an next one where, and, I, and them teeth are going, you know. Fem teeth is a pressure, pressure people and don't make them have no work. And suffer people. So when you don't have no work and you can't buy no food, you have a lose blood. So you like, you get mag and mag, like my suck your blood by not giving you any work. So we just say modern vampires of the city hunting blood, blood, blood. I say you could have come from Rima, you come from Jungle, one blood. You could have come from Firehouse or Towel, one blood, and us put Rima and Jungle upon the world map. Firehouse and Towel upon the world map. And you could have come from Libya, you come from America, Europe or Africa, us one blood, see me. You understand me? And the nation take on to it. When we were speaking, you said, you, you spoke about Bob Marley and One Love and the way yeah. that that record is held in such high regard. Mm -hmm. And you see One Blood. Yeah. Do you see One Blood in that same regard? Because it's One Blood, it's One Love, it's this oneness, it's that Rasta, that Rasta oneness. Yeah, man, you see it as, as you know, as one, you know, oneness. So you understand me? Because One Blood, you understand me? That should say, One Love, I should say we are one. 
And you see how you get the one love you now is when two persons come together now and, 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 and they bring forth a youth, which youth have the same blood, so it becomes one blood, one blood, same way. Although you have a lot of people have one love for enough different things, because you have someone have one love for those who kill people. Man have one love for those molest little children. Man have one love for those in care. Man have love for them things, but that's one blood, everything bleed red, you understand me? So, uh, you see, after them get, uh, after, because you see, you see Bob Marley and them man, you know, them man, they have inspiration. The man, they are Dennis Brown and Hugh Mundell and them man, they inspire me. You understand me? And them get out them soldier there. But when them get out them soldier, they have to have other soldiers to come take it to the next level. You understand me? And we give thanks to you know, say, when Bob Marley, when them, when them get to the king, you know, at them time, he rise, at them time, he, me, me come into the business, foreign mind, at them time, he 83. You know, you know, little after them get, you understand me? So when I come on the TV, I never come as a, as a ball, then I go dread. When them see me and Natty Congo, they say, so if I'll we get out one dread, I need a dread there. Jai don't plant him seed already, you understand me? So when we come, and we stay so, you know, we just come do the work, and we do, and just carry through the work. You understand me? And we feel proud of myself, you know, so I me, me hold the fire, even though they don't give me the praise, we know, say, the people, them out there, the whole world know that. Because, you see, you see since I get to the Bob Marley, me, Junior readers, as a Rasta man, them say, you know, the national billboard, number one on the billboard chart, this is why I'm at. I'm pretty kid before it even reached number one. I was just and one blood with ask. the game, number one album. You understand me? So as a Rasta, no other artist, you know, a reggae artist, going to the billboard too, you know, but me I talk about as a Rasta, Rasta man. You understand me? I carry the culture independently from JR label. Because look here, a lot of people think I was signed to a major label, you know. No people afraid to come to me because them think, say, oh, this man moving is moving like he's on a major label. While they never know that I was just doing that independently. You understand all those songs? I never sign when I sing in all those songs. Real gangsters don't play. Me and Fabulous, Wu Tan Clan, One Blood with me and. Um, yeah, with me and Master Killer, and me and Ghostface Killer, and the Riza for Jarrell and all them things. Independently, me and the Guru, you name it. You understand me and Alicia Keys with the No One remix. Independently. We just independently understand so. I don't have to ask the question, <laughs> what did One Blood do for you then, really and truly? Because huh? I don't have to ask the question, what did no, One, one Blood do for you? No, One do everything for me. One Blood changed my life, man. You understand me? Yeah, and, you know, and save a lot of life. So once it save a lot of life, that's my joy. You understand? One Blood unite the Cribs and the Bloods in America. Unite the whole Africa. Unite the whole world. So this is bigger than even record sale and bigger than money. You understand me? I'm bigger than Grammy, I'm bigger than Oscar, any, any award. How, how, did those, how did those rappers and all those, what they would say, big name, mainstream names, how did they take to you? How did they deal with you? Did they look at you as Junior Reed, the superstar here? If they look at me as Junior Reed, the superstar yeah. here? Well, you see, when the rappers them see me sometimes, all the rappers, them, the love for them give me, and all them rape me, all them deal with me. Sometimes all the rappers them move, would have moved like say me all richer than them. That's why I asked you the question. That's why I asked <laughs> the question. You understand me? Just, just by them action and it's just so them time to make, sometimes you have to wonder, say, where they? I wish for my money there. I have my money. Bring it come fast, you know? You understand me? Cause, you understand me? Because you have some people design around here for us, all and for artists money and try to get rid of artists around here, you know? You understand me? But this bigger than money. You understand me? Because you see, my blessing, from, from Zion, from the most side. You understand me? Which is life and love forevermore. And my blessing, you see my blessing? It's for know so I can deal with my youth, them, you know, and I see where I go on the earth. Because I know for my bridge in them, not really there right now. For even them among some youth, and can see them youth, and can hold a conversation that is more than billions and millions. When you can deal, you understand me? So you youth can see, so you know. I'm going to have to tell you youth, tell you youth you about him father, you know, him know him father. But but all oh, oh, them set the system to make no youth know them father, and that is not a good thing. You understand me? Because every youth want to be like him father. You understand me? Whether good or we are bad, we are so. You understand me? So, we give thanks for the music do for me as a youth. I grew up in a one like one room with my granny and my little brother and sister. Woke up on one bed and stay so. And for one banana we are eat it, and one this we are eat, and and, and wish for my reach and where we can, you know, help enough people and do enough things. You understand? Now, I know that on a global level, One Blood did its thing, but we can't not talk about the label. GR, yeah, that's what I was going to say, because we don't, we don't, GR label, 
there would be no one blood. Do you know what? <laughs> I'm a seven inch record, my boy. Yeah. <laughs> Se- I'm a seven, seven inch record, record right. my boy. Yeah, because check it out. A lot of people don't know that, say, is Junior Reed produced all these these singers and these songs. Rapper and Pam Pam. Yeah, Rapper Pam Pam. Banana Boat Man. Man. All Fruit Tribe. Listen to the voices. Mushing up the earth. Friend Enemy. Bad Man. Foreign Mind. All of them so one blood. All your production. Yeah, Foreign Mind produced by Sugar Mind and me, but the rest of the songs, them, you understand me? It's just GR production and, you know, are you musically Same trained? Boat. Are you musically trained or are you just a vocalist? Can you play keys, guitar, something like that? No, I can play the drum. I can play no keyboard or nothing else. But I can play the drum. I play around the keyboard, but I don't really know it that much, you know? So how, so do, you find, how, do, you, how do you find your way around the studio to produce these songs and work with the musicians? Well, when I find myself around the studio, I'm just in the studio and we're we playing musicians for coming and, you know, we just start playing. We just make sometimes with Sometimes we do demo, demos. Uh, when we work on one blood, we do demos before we go to the studio. We work out on the demos, then we go into the studio and we just lay them down. And then now, uh, sometimes we just go into the studio and we just say, yo, I want a rhythm here. Yeah. It can be a rhythm out there already, or you can be something where you just a create. And then we say, we need something like that. But something, like, you understand me? And we start playing, then you can do it, and you add where you add to it, and tell them what you want, or so and so. And, you know? If you know the sound, if you go, the st- you go into the street and you watch all the, you watch all the people that move, you watch, you know, you watch all the dancers go and all them things, you get inspired, so you know the kind of temper you must go into the studio and produce, you know, you understand me? That's why I have to ask you about Junior Reed, the producer. Yeah. Because one of my favorite records on your label yeah. is the Baby Wayne. Can't can so. so. ah, and the same ah. rhythm as All Fruits Tribe. All Fruits Tribe, right, right. Crazy juggling. Yeah, and a lot of people don't know that I produce album with them, with, we say, I have two Ninja Man album on the label. We have Dennis Brown album, Mighty Diamonds album on the label. Big Youth, Jay Youth album on the label. Spanner Banner, White Mice, myself. You understand me? Yeah, no artists, you understand me? Even have Water Blood and Andrew Blood, my son, them album on the label. Jojo Blood, them album on the label. Young GR, the label. You understand me? And we don't stop. You understand me? We keep putting out stuff and so and so. And you understand me? It's not get more serious now because we are going to production fully, fully right now. It seems like the business part of it is very yeah. seri- serious to you. Because when we yeah. mention the word contract, everybody busts everybody bus out laughing. Yeah. Um, and it sound, sounds to me that with the JR label, you were serious about yeah. your business. How right. important was that to you as a, as a Jamaican artist? Um, what, the label? No, just the business side of it, because a lot of the artists that from your age um, range, your era, your generation, yeah. we, 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 we hear the stories about right. them not having much at the end right. of it. That's why I have to produce myself and own my masters. You understand me? Because when you own your masters, if somebody record back over your songs, they have to pay you, pay you after each record that's themselves. Uh, whatever, so you understand me? Uh, so, but when you don't own your masters and somebody record over by your song, you know, just get publishing and everything from that. You understand me? And, you know, we learn how to f- know so well, keep your publishing and everything there. You can get administrator for your administrator publishing, but you don't sell out your publishing just like that. Although I can't tell nobody where for do still, but me don't, you understand me? You know? Yeah, and just things like that, you understand me? And, and even and, across and, and the when way. You have the freedom, when you have the freedom, when you have the freedom, you know, you, when you have the freedom, right, you can come out when you want to come out. So that, that you know, you, you keep that independence there, you understand me? Because you have some label where you will work with them and just have you sit down. Whereas if it's, a, if it's the last album for come out, you, you, you understand me? Them wall you and wall you and wall you. Yeah. Give thanks enough for coming in. Give thanks to the gathering. Yeah, right now, Tuna Reed. Longside, the firehouse man. Judge from the firehouse. And right move from the firehouse. This song I'm gonna sing for you. This song was done by Tuna Reed and Black Uhuru. What 
to get a hit you up for fit you up for fit it fit 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 get a hit you up for fit fit it fit it fit fit to wait the chart you got to smart 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 get the chart you got to smart 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 well in the morning as I rise put on my trucks and exercise reggae music make me fit fit it fit 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 Walk on the road, me no chop, me no want, me no eat, no steak, me no eat, no hot. Grandma, grandma, I'm a bitch, see you around. Music is my ambition. Go in on the feet, go dig some yam. Pick some can use it, because some man scoop me the cup. Get the fin yam. Stand in the sing, oh, what I'm about. Look how me big, look how me strong, strong. Say me most live long. Hey, she woke you boy. Look how me big, look how me strong, strong. Me a vegetarian. Call on, eh, ho. Fit you up for fit you up for fit it fit 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 get a hit you up for fit fit it fit 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 to it the chart you got to smart 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 hit the chart you got to smart 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 in the morning as I rise put on my trucks can exercise you up for fit you up for fit you up for fit it fit 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 walk on the road me no chop me no want me no eat no steak me no eat no ham run my room as a bitch here and music is my occupation. Use my money by food and this now. Use my money bought me a free base. Don't my pants drop off my waist. No one feel like, like me out of space. This is my first song in Black World. First release. First single, right? From the album Brutal. Hey. From city centre to Sutton Street. My heart skip a beat. Oh, hear me now. Silence in the court. <laughs> Do you swear to tell the truth? Nothing but the truth, the whole truth. Youth, I swear, I swear. The judge didn't have no sympathy on me. Oh no, only heaven is mine. A conviction that I find. All the heaven is mine. Give away your conviction and I find. The judge was my namesake. Deep in his heart, he don't decide to give away a break. All the heaven is mine. A conviction that I find. All the heaven is mine. A conviction that I find. So you know what? Fit you up for fit you up for fit it fit it fit fit get a hit you up for fit fit it fit fit to win the chart you up for smart 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 yeah. So when we when we talk about your your success in the mainstream, yeah. you, you even got pop music. Yeah, I got pop. Yeah. Tell tell me so about. I, I got pop before I got hip hop. You know. <laughs> I got pop with I'm free to do what I want. In the earth time. Don't be afraid of your freedom. I'm free to do what I choose to get my blues. In your time, love me. Oh, don't. These are the words made from my granddaddy. He says, Nice to be free. Nice to be free. Free from the lock. I miss a free like from the DJ. Don't be afraid of your freedom. DJ, me DJ. Yeah, so DJ, a DJ. DJ. Oh, so bring by the DJ <laughs> style. I'm free. <laughs> And then we say, stop this crazy thing. Come on, everybody, let's do it right. Stop the fuss, stop the fight. Come on, everybody, let's do it right. Stop this crazy thing. And then we do a song with, with Raga Twin. You know Raga yeah, Twin? Of course, yeah. Raga Twin's so, from North London. We do Shine Eye Girl with Raga Twin. And at that time, Michael Jackson was passing through London. And him do an interview with the Vice, or one of them people there. And I asked Michael Jackson, who I'm reg in favorite reggae artist. And Michael Jackson said, Junior Reed. Are you serious? Yeah, more of, yeah. When I tell him, Michael Jackson said, Junior Reed. I'm, that's why when we when sing over Michael Jackson, I see them eat like mashing up. Do you ever make a circle? Michael Jackson yeah. said, Down in. Uh, uh, and I'll go up with Diana. Wait, well, why you tell her that it's human nature? <laughs> are you yeah. a Michael Jackson fan? A proper. You are obviously a Michael yeah. Jackson fan. Yeah, me and Michael Jackson fans. And maybe me and Michael Jackson are family. You never know, because me have Jackson in my family too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for real. So, you know, as me I say, 
What is it about so, Michael Jackson's music that grabs you, that you feel that you have to do no, a cover? No, Michael Jackson inspire me. When me hear Michael Jackson sing, I want to sing. When me hear Dennis Brown sing, I want to sing. When me hear you, Mondel and Loxy Castell and Fred Lux and Sertman, I want to sing. When me hear Bob Marley and them, I want to sing. You understand me? So, you know, it's a lot of inspiration. Only song I'm going to sing for you is from the album called Emmanuel Carlin. And this one, yeah, it's about all the mashing of the earth. And we tell you that the voices are trying to be free. Yeah, hear the voices every day. Holy man, you will like King Celestia. Yeah, that's the far right. Turn the mic some more. I need some more mic, man. Like I'm straining to sing. This is BBC in Shawnee B. Holy man, you will like King Celestia. Hey, Mr. King Manuel say now free water away. 7 and 13 miles a ship. So Pharaoh, free Manuel children now. Out of Egypt, Jamaica. Out of the diaspora. So I say. Mashing up the earth, earth. Get to use it. One of these try, try. Politicians, them are sent to fraud. Keep the youth them guns and ties. Do you ever make a circle? Then it read my heart jungle before. Not to mention the Balikana. I see they use them still a ah, ah, ah. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah. Ooh. 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 I make a step in America, unite the Crips and the Bloods, Bloods, yeah, the East and the West Side, they all should live in love, do you ever make a circle, down in Brooklyn or Bronx before, not to mention all of them, you them skull and bone. in the sea, sea, yes I want to live on the shore, shore, oh. why they have my people, have them living in Portmore, keep it going, out of one many people, we all want family, I want to be a friend, I want to be your enemy, do you ever make a circle, of a bobo camp before, Ten miles from the bloody city, Emmanuel living so pure. In the prison, Rockers Island, food that goes as cheap. In Babylon, it's time you see. It's time you set the captive free. Free turn your one blood. No one. No one family. Babylon, it's time you see. It's time you set the captive free. Do you ever spend a night in a Brixton prison before? Not to mention Rockers Island. See the youth have sleeping on the floor. That sing and fly around the altar of the most high. I believe birds that I believe you're coming. 
Let me hear that together. Happy birds. That, this is how we chant on the walls of Jericho. Play up on an instrument at 10 string. And the only instrument of 10 string is the human temple. Five on one and five on one. So we can use the top. Come. We birds that sing and fly around the altar of the most high. A Philly soul that find a rest in the heavenly Father's breast. Like a wandering dog that found no repose and hurt around. They came to dine. Full joy in the oh, so delightful it is to see it. I will assemble, worship the Sometimes we sing, sometimes we pray. We hear the Zion and learn thy way. I believe birds that sing and fly around the altar of the most high. I believe soul that find a rest in the heavenly Father's breast. My teacher. Thy words declare the secret of thy will. And still we seek thy mercy, praise, and give to praises. Yes. Ye nation round, the earth shall rejoice before the Lord, our sovereign King. Serve him with cheerful heart and voice with all your tongues, his glory sing. Ah, yeah. Love your people, one more tunery. When you hear the Beatles, you want to sing as when well. When you hear the Beatles, they may be some singer with the Eleanor Rigby. You know, nice like the Beatles. Uh, my, my producer told me that is, that's his favorite version, yeah. as a matter of fact. Right, because um, Rolling Stone magazine, you know, get a big write up and say, yo, it's one of wickeder than the original. So them say, them kind of ratings that them get, you know. Back to, back to Soup Dragon, you know. You see, it's a Soup Dragon company, Big Life, who, who, who it signed to it one at a time. Big Life man, uh, run by Jazz Summons, right? Mm -hmm. Jazz Summons was the manager for the, the, the group named Wham, right? That's how the, the Soup Dragon track come about. Jazz Summons was the, the manager for Wham, but at the time, no, Wham was splitting up at the time, so they was having them farewell concert over by the Wembley Stadium. And me and Black Rose was playing in the Wembley Arena. So we did, when the great train of released, now with me and Black Rose and them leather coat and thing, the Jazz Summons see me, num we got number four, because the biggest Black Rose song that got tapped in the, um, the number 40 upon the British chart and, and upon, the, upon the Billboard chart and it tapped the, the, um, the British chart as well. Mm -hmm. So for the pops. Yeah, chart. so he see me and then he left from over the stadium and come over the, are, over the, the arena and you know, say so want to meet me and everything and this man and I'm going to meet him and he start telling me, say, it's just someone some big library and so and so I'm interested and so and so. And then now uh, link up with him and so then we get find out say them time they judge Michael I leave the one forgot solo, you understand me? So him I run them man there and them thing and so we link up with him now and so him get me, me um feature a song with Cold Cut cause Cold Cut was a group where him just wanna get out, but he needs somebody to carry them out. So uh, them them already out, but them always feature artists when they come out. So them They were like a, a remix, like yeah. mashup kind of right. group as so such. So we come out with them and when we come out the one they eat, they will come out with the arm free and the one they eat, eat as well. Them time me and Lisa Stan Lisa Stanfield is my friend them time. Me, me and Lisa, Lisa Stanfield. Lisa being around the world. A, that's it before being around the world and Are I, you yeah. serious. Yeah. So when she was on she with was, Blue she Zone. Was, she was with Blue, Blue Zone. Zone. Yeah. That that time when I go to Europe, Blue Zone used to come out there as a band. To, to, to back me up, and they, just, they wasn't playing in the but they was in the background, like, like they're playing and um, stop this crazy thing with Lisa Stanfield and the whole crew and stay. So, you understand me? And then after a sudden, Lisa Stanfield just blew up big, and everybody just blew up big, and we just say, Yeah, I love it. I go on and them thing. You understand me? Do you still link with these people? Uh, well, um, we link with Cold Cut still, not on an everyday thing, but, but last year, them called me, and me and them, and Lee Scratch Perry, them sent on a thing with Lee Scratch Perry. And one more, one more vice on it, so we just give it to them also, you know? Where do you think reggae music is right now in 2023, Junior? As somebody that, as somebody that has contributed so much to the music, 
and here I am in Jamaica. And I'll be honest with you, it's getting better yeah. to know that reggae music is playing again right. in Jamaica. Right. But there was a time that I felt like I wasn't hearing yeah. the music no in a way music, yeah. that people want to hear reggae music right. in Jamaica. Right. We're on the big sound systems. They, yeah. pe people come to Jamaica for that authenticity, that, that Jamaica vibe. A uh, creator your foot, you know what I mean? Clarks, yeah. reggae, bass line, the smell of the food, the ganja, the marijuana, e everything. But it feels like that reggae component was missing for a moment. Right, right. Because, you know, there's a lot of money spending to kill the reggae music around here. You understand me? You understand me? Because, you see, when them take away the pressing plan from out of Jamaica, them take away the opportunity for us to press vinyl and all them things. You understand me? And, and you have overseas people to come here and buy out all of the big studio board them where they know to work on the hit songs them down here already. So For that sound. Yeah, yeah, if you get that sound there and you find out say, less live concert. That's why I have to start the Friday night live in the city at the Junior Reed Entertainment Center, 39B Eastwood Park Road, where you find the One Blood Studio in half a tree. We have to set up that because we find out say you don't have much, you don't have no live, live music in the city. And this is, and this is where reggae comes from. And if you got Australia, or Brazil, or go anywhere in a Japan or anywhere in the world, in Europe, everywhere you have hundreds of bands playing, and you understand me? And the youth them now, one to the younger youth them ever come. If I just the laptop them ever learn to play the music, I find them not gonna fuck up on a keyboard and play, play a music, produce a music, or use a live bass and play, and use a live drum. So you find out, say, you know, over week the thing can get weaker. The, and then, first, the first thing you ask me. And next, I don't want to cut you. And next thing again, you find out, say, in a Jamaica, you know, I just one band. Them have a, a back every show around here. One band. So right now, like, them, like reggae music, I get a rough cut right now. Because everywhere is just rough cut. Rough cut, rough cut, rough cut, rough cut. <laughs> and that's what so you know, no, So listen, listen. <laughs> so you were going on. So you were not. You see, you see the great musician, them know, we're supposed to be able to play the music. Them gone to nine to five. In a Jamaica, in America, all over the place. I'm going to go to America the other day for the Radio City Hall. And we need to organize a band. And we couldn't find a band where the money I work, I work two days and I'm not, I'm not available Friday. Not got, so, how it all work? You understand me? And reggae music is so big where you should have enough music school around here. So, enough government should spend whole heap of money in a music that's enough youth get the right tool for work with because the youth them get the wrong tool, you know, which is a gun, you know, mm. the wrong instrument. Which is a gun, because a gun is an instrument, just like the instrument, all of them things is instrument. Same here. So you see, if, if them provide more of that for the youths, them, you know, say, Jamaica is, would be one of the richest places in the world. Do you think there was an ignorance, a blindness, uh, ignoring to, to what p people from your era was doing? Uh, a man like you, a Barrett and Levy. Yeah, yeah they might ignore the thing, because they make it look like reggae music just start 90s, 90s, you know. Them not them forget say Shabarank and Supercat, they may devote to you, Brown and Peter Metro and certain great ones. You understand me? They devote from them time there. But they don't go think just because them man they never they under a certain label like them on a VP label. So since like from VP come look like at them time the reggae start. You understand me? That's why they don't get enough for the highlight. They don't get enough for the, the foundation man, they don't highlight the business and they make a thing then. You know, them keep them show around is just who on them label them put on them show. And then we can think that they make people feel like, say, you know, go on, you know, them. But we, so we have to keep an owner showing the owner thing. You understand? That's why we say Friday night live in the city. And we go anywhere in the world and keep a show the same way. And work with who and work with we. But you understand? We keep it independent. Have you, you had to adapt to the new way of business in 2023? Streaming, online, yeah, man. social media. Yeah, we do. With it on TikTok? Yeah, yeah. with it on TikTok. <laughs> we are stream. All of my fans of us go to stream June and on all digital platforms. You know, some GR production, all of my thing them upload because you know what happened? Not for those producers back in those days who they do some produce them tune and a care go get certain company. Them can't upload them catalog now. Is those company upload them catalog. But me can't upload the whole of my thing them right now because me never did give them to nobody. You understand me? Wow. Yeah, because even the other day, a, a, a company like VP come to me you now and want to give me five hundred dollars for license, one blood for put on them, them fart it. Album, and tell him, I tell him, say, for 500 I can't buy my crepe, my lord. <laughs> the crepe, you understand me? 500 US I can't buy my crepe, even my step. You see me, I say, so, and you know, you understand me? And we sell my thing, you know how much money we make half of one word from them time, I'm the, half of that. I won't even know, say that sell. You understand me? So, I pay disrespect, them, them, it's a musical slavery I go on. 
Because what song like One Blood where you would have booked me and want to pay me X amount of all 30,000 for come perform. And the same song I come perform at the same song there, make you want to book me, but at the same time you want to come where So I find anything I'm going to do me that. Where they're going to do to some next man of slavery, I go on musical slavery. You understand me? I'm not afraid to talk out. This is a BBC, we go worldwide, so they may know. You understand me? They would film for stand up for them things, stand up for the production. Yeah, and you understand me? Yeah, stand up for your freedom. That's you can put out your thing when you want, put it out and them things. You understand? The great words of Junior, yeah. one blood root. A lot, a lot of the, the producers, them, you know what the mafia do with them catalog now, if you can put it out back. The mafia get the next artist and put him in the song. Like if me have a Dennis Brown, him get a. He try to get a junior and put another Dennis Brown so it becomes a new recording so he can put that out. But he can put out the original one when we don't sign out to them company, they're ready. You understand me? Yeah, so, you know, So you know, know. Tell me about new music, Junior Reed in 2023. Well, new music right now, as I say, we, right now we are, we, 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 right now, our mission right now is to just Make them know what time it is about reggae and show them. So reggae music is the biggest thing in the world. That's why we take the time out for me and my, se- my son, Water Blood, have this new song out named No Ice Cream Love. When you listen to it, a the real one drop, authentic reggae, rubber dub style. Get play with day. Yeah. Well, this song is my brand new release, Tyco Ice Cream Love. And this one was produced by Junior for JR Production. And this, this song is a song, you know, with me and my son. And he's also my artist, my son is my artist. Come in water blood. Say it. Standing one. Three love her where she want, yeah. Two love her where she want, yeah. I don't want no ice cream, love it's too cold for me, girl. Next mic. I don't want no ice cream, love. Girl, can't you see, girl? Because my love. It's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Say be good with I say my love. It's warmer than a chocolate fudge. I want a love that's warmer than a summer sunshine. Yeah. I want a love that's warm and pure as mine. That's why I say because my love. It's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Yeah, we have this and it just have love sauce. My love, it's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Yeah, we have this and it just have love sauce. Now I no ice cream love, one love we can't forget. Well, if I tell the daughter road, you know me something said. Can one the boy beside me say anywhere me step? And anywhere me step, I just find a grand respect. Like a house of boy I leave you, I so we make she wet. Said I love your trunk like concrete, with sweet things said. Call a man up and then leave. Say so the thing said, hey, give me the love in a request because I don't want no ice cream, love is too cold for me, girl. Oh girl, I don't want no ice cream, love. Girl, can't you see, girl? I want a love that's warmer than a summer sunshine. Yeah. Love in the winter to be warm and pure as mine. That's why I say, because my love, it's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Yeah, we have this and the girl love love so. My love, it's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Yeah, we have this and the girl love love so. You love me right, you treat me right, we never fight, you never hide. Cast the bill on them for you, it takes the right team, love. Hey, you have this love for me want. Hey, you have this love for me need. Yeah, ice cream love is just not. Satisfaction for guarantee. Hey, no want no ice cream love. Me need some nice clean love. Baby girl, you want me queen. You want my dream love. No want no ice cream love. It's too cold for me, girl. Oh girl, I don't want no ice cream love. Girl, can't you see? Big up shout to me, oh girl. Because my love, it's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Say my love, it's warmer than a chocolate fudge. Bottom Yeah, we have this time the girls love so. I want no ice cream love, but I love me can't forget. What if I go lay out a road? You know this something said. Can one day by me side, me say anytime me step. And anytime me step, I just and I run respect. Like a host of for your leak, you was so we make shit. 
Yo, I know your tongue like concrete, mix with inset. Galamad up on the DJ, I saw this inset. Hey, give me the love in a request, because I don't want no ice cream love in store for me. What you say for Junior, read a word of blood? Father and son. Yeah, this is a father and son. I want, to, I want you all to go out and support this song. It's on our digital platform. Just stream it and share it, all right? Yeah. Ice cream love by Junior Reed and Water Blood. Yeah, this song was originally done by Johnny Asburn. Yeah, one of my legends. Yeah. Yeah, one of my, one of my soldiers, one of my king. You understand me? Johnny Asburn, one of my inspiration. How do you stay relevant with the new generation of ears? I'm going to stay relevant with the new generation. You know, we just know so well, we just give the youth them enough love and give me enough love. I'm going to see myself hype over them and them not, and, you know, them not showing the hypeness over me, see me. And you understand me? I never feel too big over nobody yet. I'll, I'll try to go on away. I think, I'm going to party with the youth them, eat and drink with the youth them. You understand me? And just be myself and just communicate with the, with the, with, with the nation. You know, how I write my songs them just by a conversation. So you can't say, son, don't talk to people. And then you have to talk to people because a man may say something to you and that becomes a song. You just got to turn it in a song and whatever. So, you know, or you, you, you get inspi inspiration many different ways. I'll tell you something. If there's one thing I know, when you're in Jamaica and you see the longevity of artists like yourself, a bounty killer or whatever, you're always surrounded by youth. Yeah. Always surrounded yeah, because by we help a lot of youth, Even you know? Freddie McGregor, God bless Freddie right now, yeah. Freddie right now, always surrounded by the youth right. and bringing them through and schooling them. Right, right. You know, you have to love the youth because the youths are the future, you know. You understand me? And the youths have to love themselves to and know, say, well, yeah, they have to carry on the works. You understand me? Yeah. We just know, we just know, say, well, we try to be a good father. And us, you understand me? Come and I praise myself and bring the youth them in the right way. So I teach my youth them not to go to police station. I make them go to radio station, this kind of station, <laughs> and TV station. You understand me? When I'm in trouble, I run, go run. Me should I get an award for, for how I bring my youth. You understand me? But people don't talk about the good thing with you. Them thing is very good. And if I want to... Man, my youth them, no one ever hears my youth them, they're not station on this and that. I tell them to try to bring them in another way if you keep them away. Because you understand me? The, we're not in polling station. <laughs> Not even fire station or poison. <laughs> you understand me? It must be a radio station radio or a TV station. And I, I, can, I can tell you all, yeah, honest to God. Anytime that I speak to Junior, yeah, he always says, Shani, you get my son them song, you get this, you start. Yeah, he never I, ever pushes himself, <laughs> you know. Right. But daddy <laughs> is round there, so. He's yeah, always a youth. He them, them, man. Yeah. Always a youth. So them. that's why I have to love my youth and I can't just love my youth alone because I have so much youth. I have to love other youths out there. You understand me? So when you love, spread the love with other youths out there, so your youth them get back the love. I don't feel sometimes that we raise, rise up these stars enough. And you've heard the story, and some of these stories I haven't heard. Yeah. We need to start celebrating our artists to well, the next you level. can't get them stories, because them stories have worth millions, and you know? anybody can't go get me talk about them stories. You know? <laughs> when I just talk it, talk it, but you see, true, but just, you know, where the motor, you can't hold on for everything, you appreciate something, but enough more things so you not even know. I hear that. Yeah, but one, tell the people them to so follow Jonah Reed mm. on Instagram, Real Jonah Reed. And you can check out the, the company, IG, GR Productions. You understand me? Always so check out GR business. Productions, that is a label, Real Jonah Reed. Just follow Real Jonah Reed. You understand me? Bless yeah, you. check me out on all digital platforms and everything, and the support it. The independent label because this is independent, and all my fans them out there, we have to show the indep show the majors that the independent them doing good. Because if we don't do that, a lot of people not going to want to go independent and that's them can't even have the, have the power and the strength. You understand me? But yeah. is, ladies and gentlemen, Junior One Blood Reed. Man. <laughs>